My name is Joe Van Wyck and I am a photographer in Austin, Texas. For more videos like this, please subscribe below. I discovered a little something about the Leica Q that I wanted to pass on about walking and talking vlogging style with the Q. And it has to do with that amazing manual focus on this lens. So basically what I did was I set my focus point manually at two feet. And that's about the distance that my face is away from the lens. So right now, I am shooting this wide open at f1.7, yet my face is in great focus and the background's nice and blown out. I've tried a lot of different cameras out and autofocus settings and every imaginable kind of face autofocus and multi-point autofocus and single point autofocus and all of that can be such a pain when it comes to doing this, when it comes to vlogging. So I thought I'd pass that along. Um, let me know your uh, comments below if you've tried doing this or if you have another uh, tip about um, vlogging, walking, and talking. I never cease to be amazed at the engineering of the Leica Q and the implementation of manual focus on it is no exception. Just as a reminder of how the focus scale works, if I'm set at F4, then that means that I go to this 4 down on the barrel, and if my focusing is set at 2 feet, and the gold, by the way, is feet and the white is meters, so if two feet is centered right up on that center line with the dot, that means at F4 that those few inches in front and behind my subject are going to be relatively in focus. I'm going to nail focus right at two feet. So that would extend, um, if I were at F16 stopped down, I would have a much um, a much deeper depth of field and if, then I would have nearly a foot on either side of the two feet. I'm in what's called the Piney Woods part of East Texas and I've been having fun shooting video on my Leica Q. Um, it's not a camera that was engineered from the ground up to shoot video obviously. Um, unfortunately, there isn't a mic jack input and uh, audio is a little bit lacking. And, you know, there's some other things that preclude it to be a go-to video camera for sure. But boy, um, it does take some gorgeous shots. So I hope you enjoy some of the shots of nature that I've taken since I've been here. Mm -hmm. 